Hello balloon artists. Today I'm going to show you how to make a freestanding balloon arch that is air filled. No helium, no framework, completely air filled. Hi, I'm Melanie from Balloon Artworks in Derbyshire in the UK. Let's get started straight away. For our base we're using 11 inch rounds sized to 8 inches. Okay, and if you're using a hand pump, that's about 26 strokes of the hand pump. I'm using the premium twin air sizer and that's 4.1 settings. Okay, so this inflator sizes automatically. An excellent piece of equipment. Okay, you just round those off. Make another one of those. Take your two duplets and twist together to form a cluster of four. Put that to one side. Take a 160, pinch the end, and just run the 160 through your fingers and then just tie a knot in the end and that gives you a flat, uninflated strap. Take one of your clusters of four and just wrap that, one, that 260 in just figure of eight it around and then I'm just going to tie it, okay? Take your next cluster of four, position it over the top of the first. You want to make sure that your balloons are sitting so that the top one is sitting in between two balloons on the bottom layer. Pull that strap up through the centre and just figure of eight around. Okay, take your next cluster of four, do the same thing, position the balloon in between two, pull the strap up, and then just figure of eight around that layer. And then with your last cluster, again, position it on the top and figure of eight around. Okay. So that's what you've got. Take a weight, I'm using a sand weight, which water weight would do just as well. And I'm just going to pull that into the base here. Okay, just pulling it through up through into that second layer and wrapping around, figure of eighting around those balloons. You can do this earlier, you can do this when you just do your um, second tier if you like. Okay, when we're sizing balloons we've got different ways that we can size. So my sizing box doesn't have an 8 inch slot. So today I'm going to be using the sliding size to size the balloons. Another way that we can size is to count the number of strokes we use to inflate or we can use a digital inflator. This one isn't digital. Now I want to size to 8 inches, so I've measured 8 inches and I know that for me, with this hand pump, that's going to be six, 26 strokes of the hand pump. So I'm going to count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, okay. And for this first balloon, I tie this straight off. So for this first one, I'm not tying to one of the other linky looms, just um, quick links, just, just yet, okay? So that's what you've got. For the remaining balloons, I'm going to use my inflator. And then sides. And for this type of balloon arch, it's really important that your sizing is spot on. And then I'm just tying those two balloons together. And then this is the first balloon that I inflated. I'm going to want to wrap the knot end into the base. And I just like to take the tip, pinch the air out of each, and then I tie the two together. Okay, and we can continue like this. Letting the air out until the sides of the balloon just gently touch the 
side and sides, and I can just gently pull those through, okay? And then wrap the necks over and tie. Just push the air out, those tips, and tie those two together. to go in a particular order. I do tie as I go just to avoid confusion. So this style of arch is only suitable for indoor use. It's really important to remember that. And take your uh, knot and nozzle and just wrap that through. So it, it's not a structure that is robust enough for use outdoors. And, and we've got a chain of 11 quick links here, that's pretty much uh, the maximum that you can get air filled uh, like this. So beyond 11 and you're starting to struggle, uh, the um, arch doesn't stay upright, just air filled. Okay. And then just adjust your bases and pull them outwards. until you're happy with how it looks and you need to do that from a distance. A couple of things to remember with this type of arch, it's only suitable for indoors and make sure you stick to no more than 11 quick links um, air filled because beyond that and your arch isn't going to hold up. I'll see you again in the next video.